Hello there and welcome to Complete Games with me James. Hope you guys are all doing well and we continue with my guide to all the artifact locations on the Crystal Isles map. Today we're going to be going for the artifact of the Cunning. This one again quite an easy one to get to but it will require you to go underwater. So in my case I'm grabbing a Lazarus Chowder because I've been cooking plenty of exceptional kibble. But one of those or the scuba tank is advisable. It's not too deep but it's still better to have some sort of breathing equipment and it's better to have a water dyno as well although it's not too far away from the surface so what we're going to do is we're just going to head south from my headquarters to the furthest island straight this way So just spin around so you can see where them rock formations are there and hopefully you can get your bearings as to where I am. So it's this little island here, we've got some crystal on the left. I'm just going to come in and land here. And let me give you the coordinates for where I am. It's better to start out I think on the beach. There we go, 81.9. 24.8 is where I'm standing and the artifact is just literally out in front of us here I've got me Basilo so it will be a little bit quicker and there are plenty of jellies and anglerfish the odd moser about so it's better to have a water dino of any sort let's just have me Lazarus Chowder Okay, so what you're looking for is this horseshoe shape just here. And from here, just dive down and you'll see a white crystal come out of the abyss. There we go, just in there. Watch out for that angler. And there we are, there's the artifact and the crystal generally pops out at you before the artifact does. So that's the artifact of the cunning and I'll just grab it quickly before this angler fish gets back. And that's the Artifact of the Cunning, the first of a few artifacts that can be found underwater. I of course will be covering all 18 of the artifacts and their locations in a little playlist, so if you're struggling to find any of the others, check that out. And like I say, I think it's probably best to take some sort of breathing equipment and a water dyno to tackle that one. If you're new here, why not consider subscribing? I do plenty of other arcs, guides and tutorials and let's plays, but until next time, I'm James from Complete Games and I'll see you.